Hello everyone, this is Farzan here from Language Academy with another video today. Guys, in this video, I want to discuss one important aspect of our reading module that is your time management. Now, as you guys are already aware of the fact that the PT pattern has been changed and the number of questions has been reduced and they have reduced the time of the exam as well. So before the exam used to be like around two and a half to three hours, but now they have reduced it to be only two hours. Now, because of that, they have considerably, like they have reduced the number of questions, but they have also reduced the timing of that. Now, in this video, I will be talking particularly about the reading module because I have seen that some students are struggling with the time management aspect of their reading section. Guys, remember that in your reading, you will have a collective time. So in your speaking and writing, everything is timed very individually. Like, for example, you are getting 40 seconds for the describing it, you are getting like 40 seconds for the retail lecture. 20 minutes for the essay, 10 minutes for the summaries, everything is timed individually. But in your reading, you won't have an individual time, but you will have a collective time. You will have around, um, you can say something around 29 to 31 minutes. And in that time, you have to finish around 14 to 16 questions. So you have to manage your time by yourself. Time management is very important in your reading. Now, what we have seen is, that many students, they spend too much time on the less important questions and because of that, they have less time for the important ones. Guys, remember this thing that in your reading, three tasks, they are very, very important. Fill in the blanks, drag and drop, fill in the blanks, drop down menu and reorder paragraph. They are the most important ones. So you have to do those correctly if you want to get your score. Now, um, in the real exam, Remember, do not spend too much time on the multiple choice, multiple answers. Be very careful about it. Multiple choice, multiple answers is the second task of your reading. So don't spend any time on this. If you spend time on the reading blanks, reading, writing blanks and reorder paragraph, you will very easily be able to get your score. I have seen some students, especially in the lab who are doing their mock test, they are spending like three, four minutes on their multiple choices. Because of that, they are saying, okay, I missed one blank or I missed the whole, uh, like two or three questions of the drag and drop reading. That is not good at all because that could be the make or break of your whole exam. Remember this thing for your multiple choices, try to do it as quickly as you can. So I would recommend just skim through the text very carefully and try to find your answer within 30 to 40 seconds, not more than that. And then just put any answer you want if you can't find it and move on to the next one. If you do well in your blanks and all, and even if you are struggling in uh, multiple choices, it doesn't matter. You will very easily be able to get your score. Okay. So I want to clear this doubt from this particular video that spend time on the blanks and reorder paragraph and make sure that you are doing multiple choices very quickly. Now, something about the new pattern is that they have reduced the number of multiple choices, but the number of fill in the blanks and the reorder paragraphs, they are exactly the same. But they have reduced the overall time from around 41 minutes to around 31 minutes. So time management is becoming a little bit tricky. So that is why we have designed mock test in our portal. Make sure that you attempt that. Okay. That will give you a very clear idea about how to manage your time properly and how to be in that exact atmosphere that you will face in the real exam. So that is why um, we have all the resources here to help you cope up with this time management aspect of it. Don't just do reading and go for it because that will be the whole different game when you have to manage your time under a lot of pressure. So try to do these mock tests, get the feedback from us um, and we will help you out to get your desired score. But be very careful about the time management aspect of it. Many students are taking this for granted, but do not do that. It could be a make or break of your exam. Thank you so much for watching this video guys. I will be back with some more videos. Thank you so much.